VPN Remote Access with Active Directory Group. In this video, we will present two new capabilities of VPN Remote Access with Active Directory, multi-factor authentication and root traffic. Let's start with configuring multi-factor authentication globally for all users. Select the two-factor authentication checkbox on the Remote Access Blade control page. Then click Configure and select the required two-factor authentication method. Click Save and then click Save again on the blade control. Now go to Remote Access Users page. Here we have a local user with a VPN policy with tag Global Settings. This tag means that we are using the global policy. Let's edit the group policy for a specific Active Directory group. We are going to override the global setting by selecting Override Global Settings checkbox and enable two-factor authentication checkbox afterward. In this example, for this Active Directory group, we would like to use the Authenticator app. The Active Directory group now has a different policy. There is also an option to override Route All Traffic per Active Directory group. The Route All Traffic can be configured on the Remote Access Advanced page by selecting the relevant checkbox. This checkbox is off by default. Now, let's enable Route All Traffic for the specific Active Directory group. Let's go back to the Active Directory group that was edited and select Override Route All Traffic for this group. We can see that the policy has changed for this group. The group can now connect via the Authenticator app and all traffic will be routed through the VPN.